Hi all. So today's video is about uh, the R exit. So we are going to fix a chamber to the R exit. So you know I bought the chamber for another project, but uh, I decided that we'll fix it on the R exit because since we have a chamber, let's see. So to fix the chamber on the bike, we need to move the bike out of here. So let's go ahead and park the bike somewhere near the Zen over there. Uh, so that would give us a better place to start working on the bike. Doesn't look like this guy is going to let me work. So is that guy. So both of them are turning little violent. This guy is all out loose. He has uh, started biting me. <laughs> Is very jumpy and bitey. So this is a chamber that we brought. We brought a proton chamber. So this was brought for the big board project. So this guy is going to keep on interrupting. So what do you want? What do you want? Okay, you want me to play? Not now. Let's play later. I have some work to do. Okay. Go, 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 let's play later. Okay, so back to work. Let's see how the stock exhaust sounds like. This uh, is a dB meter that I have decided to use and it is around 114.5 decibels uh, for the stock exhaust. Uh, so yeah, let's see how much the chamber sounds. So let me start going ahead and removing this. But in the meantime, this is pretty loud, but since it sounds very really sweet, uh, let's see. So I need some tools. Uh, so these are the tools you need, a ratchet, a 17mm extension, a socket as well as an extension, and a 12mm socket. Um, so you're going to use these three tools to remove uh, the stock silencer and uh, replace it with the chamber that we have. So let's go ahead and remove it. Okay. So we have removed the uh, silencer and installed this proton chamber. So let's hear how it sounds. So I have the dB meter with me on the phone and let's hear how loud it is. So let me just set up the dB meter. Just give me a sec. Okay, so we have the dB meter set up. So what we are going to do is we are going to start the bike and hear it and see how loud it is. So sorry about the shaky camera because I'm holding the camera in one hand. So it has actually gone up till around 110 dB. 
uh, which is little less than what the stock silencer had uh, produced so that was at around 114 db but still the sound is little loud and it doesn't sound as sweet as the um, RXZ4 speed silencer so I've slightly cut the flute on the uh, silencer that's why it is little loud so if I fix the stock flute which I have with me so if I fix that then the sound actually goes down a bit um, so yeah let's go ahead and remove this and install our stock silencer back so it is just the reverse process of whatever I did just now so we need to just remove two bolts uh, I mean nuts one is the 17 mm nut and there is a 12 mm nut here so we just need to remove that plus there is a bolt that goes under there which is not installed as of now but once I install the 4 speed silencer I will go ahead and install that bolt as well dude you are back again ok so this there is this uh, clamp there so once it is installed this will become little sturdy right now it is little shaky the brake pedal is absolutely useless so I have to use a 5 speed brake pedal which I have so I am going to remove this and install the 5 speed brake pedal so other than that uh, most of the work is complete so I have installed the uh, RXZ silencer it is ok so before she goes ahead and damages anything further let me just turn off the bike okay so that's about it um, so let me just fix that one bolt because of which it is slightly wobbly so once I fix that bolt then this will all become one so there are a couple of works pending one is I need a straight bar crash card and I also need those uh, reflector that comes on the side and then I need to fix this wobbly uh, this thing also the wobbly visor there is a, a bracket that comes under so that bracket will stop it from wobbling like this I have kept the bracket somewhere I need to look for it so once I find it then I'll install it on this so other than that the bike is pretty much complete uh, it so if you like watching the video then consider subscribing to the channel uh, I've also started uh, a Hindi version of uh, you know a Hindi channel for my subscribers from the Hindi heartland so if you would like to see this video in Hindi then subscribe to the other channel given in the description so I hope you enjoyed the video have a great day bye bye